And I wonder what the future of IDEs looks like. So the tooling of interacting with AI systems, this is true for programming and also probably true for in other contexts, like computer use, but maybe domain specific, like we mentioned biology, it probably needs its own tooling about how to be effective and then programming needs its own tooling. Is Anthropic gonna play in that space of also tooling potentially? I'm absolutely convinced that uh, powerful IDEs, uh, that, that there's so much low hanging fruit to be grabbed there. Um, that, you know, right now it's just like you talk to the model and it talks back, but, but look, I mean, IDs are great at kind of lots of static analysis of, of, you know, so much as possible with kind of static analysis, like many bugs you can find without even writing the code. Then, uh, you know, IDs are good for running particular things, organizing your code, um, measuring coverage of unit tests. Like there's so much that's been possible with the normal, with the normal IDs. Now you add something like, well, the model now, you know, the model can now like write code and run code. Like I am absolutely convinced that over the next year or two, even if the quality of the models didn't improve, that there would be enormous opportunity to enhance people's productivity by catching a bunch of mistakes, doing a bunch of grunt work for people, and that we haven't even scratched the surface. Um, Anthropic itself, I mean, you can't say, you know, no, you know, it's hard to say what will happen in the future. Currently, we're not trying to make such IDs ourselves. Rather, we're powering the companies like Cursor or like Cognition or some of the other, or, you know, uh, Expo in the security space. Um, uh, you know, others that I can mention as well that are building such things themselves on top of our API. And our view has been: let a thousand flowers bloom. We don't internally have the the re, you know the resources to try all of these different things let's let our customers try it um uh and you know we'll see who succeeds and maybe different customers will succeed in different ways uh so I, I both think this is super promising and you know it's not it's not it's not something you know anthropic isn't isn't eager to to at least right now compete with all our companies in this space and maybe never yeah it's been interesting to watch cursor try to integrate claw successfully because there's it's actually I mean, fascinating how many places it can help the programming experience. It's not as trivial. It is. It is really astounding. I feel like you know, as a CEO, I don't get to program that much, and I feel like if six months from now I go back, it'll be completely unrecognizable <laughs> to me. Exactly.